Uh, what uh, is in your hair? I'm, I'm, my I'm, gift! <laughs> I'm losing my gift! What? Encano, from the moment it was released in 2021, captured the hearts of audiences all around the world. The musical fantasy film which tells the story of the magical family who live in an enchanted Colombian village where every member of the family possesses a unique magical power immediately became a fan favorite. It's a film that showcases the power of storytelling, the importance of representation, and the magic of animation. And like every great movie, fans can't seem to get enough and are clamoring for a sequel. In this video, I'll be telling you everything you need to know about Encano 2, from plot, trailer, cast, and release date. So sit back, relax, and let's go on a magical journey. There is nothing wrong with La Casa Madrigal. The magic is strong! Let's start with the plot. Even though the first movie ended really well, we are still left with some unanswered questions. And there are several fan theories going around about what the focus of the sequel will be. We all know that Encano 2 will take place after the events of the first movie. If you remember very well, in the first movie, we see Mirabelle go through a lot to save the family's magical home, the Castia, after it starts to crack and the candle begins to flicker. Mirabelle flees after the Castia is destroyed and the candle dies, believing it was her fault. After reconciling with Abuela, the Magicals reunite and rebuild the Castia together with the community. Using the doorknob she receives, Mirabelle restores the magic for everyone in the house when she places it on the front door. And even though Mirabelle was able to return everyone's magic back, she was still not given any special powers, and this of course left fans wondering. So there is a high likelihood that Encano 2 will once again revolve around the character of Mirabelle Madrigal, who will embark on yet another adventure with their family. It is expected that the sequel will focus on Mirabelle as she grapples with the responsibility of being the next Madrigal matriarch, while also navigating the complexities of her own life. We can expect to see more of the family's magical powers, as well as the deep bonds that hold them together. It'll be interesting to see all the family members use their magical powers to the fullest. What will make it even more interesting is getting to explore explore more of the Magical family's individual stories and struggles. We all know the family members grew under Abuela's firm hands and know that she has learned to become more gentle and accepting, and it'll be fun to see how they all learn to live their lives on their own terms. What choices will they make, and will they enjoy it as much? Luisa, could you bring over the piano? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Jessica Darrow, who voices Louisa, shared her thoughts about what she hopes will become Louisa now. In an interview with BuzzFeed, she said, I want Louisa to take a break. I really want the humanization of Louisa. You know, we all saw all of the hard stuff that she has to deal with and the anxieties that she experiences. I want to see a day where she goes to get to experience joy and relaxation and simple pleasure. I'm sure she is not alone in the sentiment because fans all over the world want to see the Magical family have a chance at a normal life, and we hope the sequel will give that to us. Another possible plot point will be having the Magical family explore the world. In the first movie, we only saw a small part of the Magical family's magical world, so a sequel could expand on that by showing us more of the Magical village and other places in the world. The family could also embark on a journey to discover new magical creatures, cultures, and challenges. This could also explore the theme of family heritage and how the magical family fits into the larger magical world. However, while this may seem interesting, from what the Encano director mentioned about the powers of the magical family, this may seem like a less magical option. In a tweet, Encano director Jared Bush explained that the family magical powers may have limitations. In response to a question about whether their powers could be used outside the village, Bush replied, They haven't been beyond Encano, so it hasn't been established. What this means is that there is a possibility possibility that the Magical family will lose their magic if they go outside the borders of their village. What will all of this mean for the family to be in a world without their powers? In Encano, we see how many of them fared without their powers, and even though this is an interesting storyline to pursue and full of lessons for viewers, I feel the directors will be less likely to go this route. After all, Encano is about magic and enchantment, and how will that be without the magic? Everything is fine. We are the Madrigals. Mirabel! 
Another theory flying around is that the sequel could get rid of all of the characters in the first movie and replace them with new characters. So instead of focusing on the previous generation, the story could focus on future generations, possibly the grandchildren of the new matriarch Mirabelle. With this storyline, we'll see many new amazing powers and new struggles. One of the most interesting ideas fans have is that instead of the sequel being an actual sequel, it is instead a prequel that goes back in time to explore the story of Abuela Alma and her husband and go into the details of the Colombian Civil War. This story could explore Abuela's childhood, her marriage, and how she guided her people to the safety of the village. It could also answer questions fans have about the magic, such as why did the magic choose the magical family? And Kano 2 could dive deeper into the sociopolitics of intergenerational trauma. This will make for a really interesting and emotional second movie. While this may seem like the least likely choice due to how dark the story is, I'm pretty sure if the writers want to tell the story, they will find a way to tell it. Not if we don't have a house. What? We don't have a house. I can't say we don't have a house. What is that? And now, let's talk about the cast. Fans all fell in love with the cast of Encano from the moment they came on our screens, and many are not ready to let go of them just yet. From the curious Mirabelle to the quirky Dolores, there wasn't a cast member that wasn't loved by the fans. So, for Encano 2, we can expect the return of the amazing and original voice actors from the first movie, including Stephanie Beatriz as Mirabelle Magical. Fans should also expect the return of John Legazamo as Bruno, Jessica Darrow, as Luisa, Diane Guerrero as Isabella, Maria Cecilia Botero as Abuela, Mauro Castillo as Felix, Angie Cepeda as Julieta, and Wilmer Valderrama as Augustin. So it's safe to say that we're in for another treat with this star-studded cast. But depending on the storyline the writers decide to take, we can expect to see some new characters join the magical family. And of course, they will be voiced by some equally talented actors. We're excited to see who these new actors are and who will be voicing them, and if you have any ideas about who you would like to see to join the magical family, let me know in the comments below. You can't say the weight of the world is on your shoulders, BN. If our fate's up to me, me says. Finally, the most important question, when is Encano 2 going to be released? Officially, Disney has not yet given a green light to Encano 2, but that doesn't mean it won't come. In February 2023, Disney confirmed sequels for a couple of their old animated movies such as Frozen and Toy Story. So, even though nothing is in the works officially, it won't hurt to speculate. After all, it took six years for the first Frozen movie to get a sequel, and Zootopia, which was released in 2016, just got a sequel announcement. The first movie took a couple of years in production before it was released and announced, and even though there is yet to be an official announcement, there is a possibility that something may already be in the works. So fans shouldn't lose hope yet. We may just be getting a sequel sooner than we expected, and no matter when the release date is, I believe I believe the sequel will be something a lot of fans will enjoy watching. That is all we know so far about Encano 2. Are you excited about the sequel? What do you think the plot will be about? Who do you want to see in the sequel? And what are you hoping to avoid? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, and if you are yet to subscribe to my channel, make sure you do that and click that subscribe button so you get notified of future updates on the upcoming movies and TV shows. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Broken to Bruno's Tower, I found his last vision. The family's in trouble, the magic is dying. The house is breaking. Luis's gift is fading, and I think it's all because of me.